Hi, this is Jay. Welcome to Bright Ideas. Ivan Pavlov The famous Russian psychologist Ivan Pavlov introduced the theory of classical conditioning through a series of experiments with dogs. Based on the law of association proposed by Greek philosophers like Aristotle, he showed that an organism can associate particular response or R. Learning as a result of an association formed between a stimulus like food and a response like the animal salivating. Later, one could substitute food with the sound of a bell or unusual stimulus and yet the animal salivates. The associations or habits become strengthened or weakened by the nature and frequency of the SR pairings. For example, when the organism realizes that the sound of the bell does not result in food, the animal stops salivating and the behavior said to be extinct. Edward Thorndike Thorndike also worked with animals and defined learning as a habit formation. In one of his experiments, a hungry cat was placed in a box and could escape and eat the food by pressing the lever inside the box. After much trial and error behavior, the cat learned to associate pressing the lever or stimulus with opening the door or response. The SR connection when established resulted in satisfying state of affairs or escape from the box. Each time the animal was put in the box, it took lesser time to press the lever and escape because the animal has learned. Based on these experiments, Thorndike proposed three laws which he called. Number 1. Law of Effect If a response like doing mathematics problem is followed by a pleasurable or rewarding experience like student gets the right answer and is praised by the teacher, the response will be strengthened and become habitual. Number 2 is Law of Exercise Connections between stimulus like getting the right answer and response like doing a mathematics problem is strengthened with practice and weakened when practice is not continued. Number 3 is Law of Readiness Certain behaviors are more likely to be learned than others because the nervous system of the organism is ready to make the connection leading to a satisfying state of affairs. It is preparation for action. The task of the teacher is to arrange the classroom and learning activities so as to enhance connection, a stimulus, and response.